What's up, y'all? It's your girl Naya, aka Tiny Dreams, and welcome back to my channel. This is the intro, I know you love it. This is the intro, I know it's knocking, and it's knocking through those speakers. And that. Y'all, I was not feeling determined to film this video because I was super cold and I'm anemic. So if you do YouTube and you're anemic, and <laughs> you know, if you know, you know, if you don't, you don't, and that's just that on me. But. You know, I had to turn on my little LED strips because you know it's on my video if I don't got these lights on. But no jokes, y'all. I literally plugged it in and it like sparked. So I was a little nervous because, you know, I'm not trying to, I don't want no fires occurring because I want to look cute in my video. But, you know, I'm going off topic. Today, y'all, I'm going to be, how do I say it? I'm going to be looking up the most Googled questions about black people, basically, because, you know, I can't do it on Spanish people. I can't do it on white people. I can't speak for y'all. I can only speak for me, and I'm black, so, you know, let me just see what I can find on my laptop. All right. If you hear chirping, y'all, I don't know what it is. There's birds in my wall. I don't know what they're doing in there, but they're doing something. You hear that? Stop talking mess, fool. I'm telling my mama. Oh, she on the way. Sometimes I just gotta hit the wall so they know to shut up. What was that? Carl, why my stuff on the floor? Why do black people age better? We age better because we got melanin. You know the sun's UV rays and all that stuff. It's harmful for our skin, but you know, we got melanin. So I'm not saying just because we got melanin, them UV rays ain't gonna protect us or them UV rays ain't gonna attack us, okay? Skin cancer is real and sunscreen is real too. You should utilize it. But it's because of our melanin. Our melanin keeps us young, looking young. Why do black women wrap their hair at night? Why shouldn't we wrap our hair at night? I used to get perms and girl, it was vital for me to wrap my hair because if I did not wrap my hair, all of that pain that I went through, okay, the freaking fire alarm going off in the salon, it, it would have all been for nothing. Every time that lady would blow dry my hair, y'all, I swear, it'd be me and probably two other people in the salon getting the hair done. And that fire alarm would go off, okay? Cause she pulling on my hair trying to make it bone straight y'all know what that is if you got perms if you get perms or if you used to get perms or if you just get washing sets and they have that heat all the way up on 400 with that blow dryer tell them to lower it down because the, by the time she was done with me you smell burnt hair so yes we gonna wrap our hair to make sure that these styles last okay why do black people have black gums why do white people have pink gums why do black women use silk pillowcases well i wish I had a silk pillowcase. I don't use a silk pillowcase, but black women use silk pillowcases so they don't get their edges snatched on that pillowcase, boo. They use silk pillowcases to protect their hair so th their hair does not experience any kind of breakage. That's why black women use a silk pillowcase. <laughs> a silk pillowcase, okay? Why do black women wear wigs? We like to switch it up. Black women wear wigs because you know what? <laughs> When they don't want to straighten their natural hair, girl, braid that hair back, throw on a wig. <laughs> you see that wig over there? If I don't want to be Naya and I want to be Nicole, if I want to be Nicole, I'll wear that wig, okay? Listen, wigs are great protective styles, and not just for black people, but just for anybody who just doesn't want to mess up their natural curl pattern and whatnot. Wearing wigs is definitely okay. There's nothing wrong with it. Why do black people wash me? I don't know, to clean it. And I know you could use other things to clean meat, but it's like, you know, we just go the extra mile, make us feel better about the meat when we start to cook it or put it in the oven or fry it, you know? Why do black people wear do-rags? Now this is for the black kings and even the queens because my sister wear a dewey. <laughs> do-rag, I, I call it a dewey, okay? Black people wear deweys because you know what? We want to keep that style in tap we want to keep that style held we want that style to be stagnant still don't go nowhere okay we want that style to stay and for the black kings okay and and not even just the black kings just for people who wear do-rags in general they want to <laughs> preserve the style that's why they wear do-rags to preserve the style they don't want their waves to go flat they want their waves to stay wavy okay can black people tan girl what yes black people could tan why do black people have long hair? 
because of genetics and because we take care of our hair okay my hair i swear i can't tell y'all how many times people ask me if my hair was mine especially when it's straight i'll insert a picture but my hair is long okay and it's probably because of genetics and i drink a lot of water and you know i take care of my hair you know all you gotta do is learn your hair what it likes what it don't like stick to what it likes and that's just that on there <gasps> why does the black community complain about racism so much slavery ended a long time ago heart my heart just went Racism in America is still alive and thriving. Do you see how cops treat black people? Do you? Do you see how when black people are pulled over, when black people are stopped by the cops, they have to move slowly? We can't just reach for something because they're going to feel threatened and shoot us. Racism is very much still alive. It, it hasn't gone nowhere. There's been, there's little progress has been made, but like this. That's smaller than my eye. We've got a long way to go. These cops oh, act like we are the aggressor when really we're human beings. We're just like you. Cut our skin open and we bleed the same. Y'all got me messed up. Hold on. Do black people blush? Girl, bye. Do black people get lice? No. No. Nope. Uh, girl, lice is attracted to clean hair. Now, I'm not saying that means black people got dirty hair. No, but we be putting that ORS olive oil spray in our hair, boo. We be putting that, that cocoa, coconut oil, all these luscious smelling products in our hair. And lice don't like that. So, I'm not saying no black people get lice, but not a lot. I'm not going wood because I, I ain't trying to cut my hair. I'm not trying to deal with them. Hello. Do black people have an extra bone? Are you serious? Are you stupid? Huh? Uh. Aaron, Aaron trying to pull me. Why are black people so loud in movie theaters? Because why not? Like, when something crazy or epic happens, like, we gotta express our feelings. We gotta express our emotions. We can't just keep that bottled up inside. That's not what we do. Like, for, let me give you an example. Diaries of a Mad Black Woman. That's all I can think about. Right? When Charles hit that lady, ooh, I was like, I came and fight y'all, so I don't even know if I'm in the right stance. But I was like, Charles! But when sis came back, when he got injured and stuff, and sis came back, letting him know what it is, he was in that tub, she was like, stop playing with them boats. Yes! Let him know. Like, Charles, you thought you was a bowl of biscuits and a bag of Skittles, but sis came through and threw you in the tub. Like, what y'all put in them greens to make them taste like that? Ah! seasoning not no salt and pepper it's more than salt and pepper you 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 don't just use salt and pepper to season your food I'm tired of people thinking oh, well i just gotta add a dollop of salt and a dollop of pepper and i'm done no you can't taste anything like that why are black people always cold in the winter no offense but why do white people wear shorts in the winter why, when there's a whole snowstorm, a blizzard outside, y'all walking outside with some swim trunks <laughs> and slip on bands and a sweater, not even a jacket. Sometimes not even a sweater. Not to be rude, but it's like, y'all asking us why we always cold in the winter. My question to you is, why aren't you cold in the winter? With all due respect, let me add that in because I don't want people thinking I'm racist, I'm not, but it's like, y'all can't just be asking these questions about us and not expect us to throw some shots back at you. Okay, okay. That's all the questions I'm gonna be answering because I'm not gonna lie, I'm starting to sweat and honestly, the sun is going down and the sliding really isn't doing me justice the way I need it to. If you like this video, please do me a favor and give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, as if you want to, of course. Y'all, I appreciate the love and support that y'all have shown me on my last video with my dear customers, Coronavirus Edition. Y'all really seem to love the dear segment. Y'all really seem to enjoy that segment and it really means a lot to me when y'all give me good feedback because I always look forward to constructive criticism. So, yeah, let me stop, let me stop blabbering around. I will see you guys in my next video.
video. All right, no, no, seriously, I I'm leaving. I'm going. Why are you still there? I said I'm leaving. Hey, I'm too high. I got hey. no fever. Hey, okay.